I dreamed of my ancestors' halls. They were empty. I dreamed of the north, of an offering left to us by Tukuhama. An offering that will save the Karui. I needed only to take it. I gathered my finest 500. I brought them here. I claimed what Tukuhama had promised me. Dereso? He's down there inside the mountain? Are we talking about THE Dereso? The Sword King? Seems like it. But how did he get in there? He left Oriath about a century and a half ago, hoping to find a cure for his lady, Merveil. He would have had to fight his way through the Marrakech, but Ayun's never mentioned anything of the sword. Maybe he didn't go in alive. What do you mean? We live in a land where the dead walk and things like Diala live for centuries. You think he died somewhere else, and then the beast got hold of him? Could be. Well, if the beast can do that, then what bloody good was Deshret's seal? Exactly. Diala said but one thing to me before descending into the mines. My love awaits. I know not why, but those three words frighten me more than any I have heard in my lifetime. Dereso. Yes, Pataras has spoken of him. The disturbing question is this. How does a man who by all accounts has been dead for over a hundred years end up as a nightmare monarch in the bowels of Highgate? Unlike Calm, there is utterly no trace of his passing, and we have scouted every footstep of this mountain and its surrounds. There is no other entrance, no physical entrance. Deshret, and now this, Dereso. Yes, most disturbing. Nightmare is not without sophistication. In life, Doreso was tortured by frustration and shame. In death, Nightmare has erased his past and forged a dream world in which Doreso would remain contented and loved. What if Nightmare could do that for all of us? Would we really wish to destroy it then? My understanding of Kawom, the man, is that he was a prisoner of his own delusions. Now, he is a prisoner of someone else's. The power of Nightmare to manipulate the soul never ceases to impress me. That could be you one day, should you continue to follow this dark and winding path. Beneath your feet, creation shivers and writhes. It yearns for transformation like a worm in a cocoon that dreams of wings and freedom. A transformation that only the beast can excite. A dark god of ancient sacrifice, a muse to the twisted and vile. The beast, the nightmare, the darkness, names given to it by mortals that think with slugs bound in shells of bone. Yet, one man knew the beast's true name, understood its impenetrable nature. Malachi.
crushed the servants of Kitava beneath our heels as we marched across the land. I allowed not one of my 500 to fall. The blood of the ancestors surged in our veins, and each and every one of my warriors earned Tukohama's mark upon their skin. We descended into the heart of Rayclast, and there he came to me, Tukohama. He asked of me a sacrifice. I gave it willingly. My axe fell five hundred times, the jade drinking its fill of Kardui blood. Tukohama was pleased. That would only slow me down. The Eternals opened the gate and invited Kitava into this land. The Karui paid the price. Kitava cut us off from the ancestors, raised the remembered as his children, tortured our dreams. Kitava murdered the Karui way. I will found a new way, for I have been chosen. I gather my forces so that I might wage war on Kitava. I am the son of Tukohama, and I will lead the Karui back to glory. The moment your skin touched the corrupted soil of Rayclast, you were infected. Kitava has soaked this land in his filth. I will crush the corruption from your bones. Drain your black blood upon this sacred ground. Brothers and sisters, I honor you with a warrior's death. Your spirits will fight by my side when we march against Kitava. You will be given in service to Tukohama. You will be remembered with glory. Death 
little angry boy for the world to deal with. Pride the fury from Calm's dead hand, did you? Or is it dead again hand? Or re-dead hand? Or is undeath really just death with benefits? In which case, you didn't kill Calm because he was already dead. It's all a bit of a grey area, really. And completely beside the point. Yet we're still one gem short. Go, not a cockroach. And relieve Dereso of his desire. <laughs> <laughs>